shotgun. shotgun. Mill shotgun, yes. Mill shotgun. Mill shotgun. Yeah. I still want it too. I still. No, you didn't. Middle shotgun. Middle shotgun. Middle shotgun. Middle shotgun. Sweet home people and trust me it feels good to be home. It was a lit trip I'm really excited to show you what was good with that. It was awesome We did a bunch of really cool stuff. We did some shopping went to the number one restaurant in the world So with no further ado, I present you the New York vlog Why don't you put one of your bag in his bag? Why don't you put your bag inside your bag and then that bag inside your bag and then your bag back inside that bag? That's Canada right there for you people. Nothing better than an old Canadian morning, eh, for the boys? What's that? Are you American? Oh no, we're full Canadian, oh, eh? Yeah, we're getting her going there, yeah. Let's get her going there, yeah. Kidoki. Good day, everybody, and welcome to another episode of the vlog. We are on the way to New York City. We're gonna be eating at the number one restaurant in the world tomorrow. That's literally why we came here. But first, before we even get into what we're doing today, we do have another joiner. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here. Yeah, it's a couple of the boys in fucking down. New York City. Let's get go. her fucking oh. going her. Trust me guys, that's why I'm telling you I'm really excited for this video because I'm going to be bringing you a bunch of good stuff. I know a lot of you have been liking the cooking stuff, but then a lot of you have been also liking some of the other stuff. So trust me, this video is going to be lit. I promise you that. You've been messing with the content, so it's been motivating me to get more stuff out for you guys. So first things first, dinner. <sighs> Do you smell pot? Yeah, I do. I do smell pot. I better call the manager. Korean Steakhouse. Apparently this place is really, really good. Kai's a huge Korean Steakhouse fan, so we'll get her going, her. You know who it is. You know you met me at Code. You know, in New York City we linked up. You know, just a couple of things to trying to link. You know, but you honestly, you filmed that. You filmed me. You know, you brought out the camera. Dog, all I'm asking, you put me in that next NYC vlog because honestly the viewers are not fucking woke enough, you know? Like, yo, I need it. Right yo, now. honestly, we're gonna get fucking going, you know? It's David, honestly, you made it out. Huge fucking game. Yo, yeah, get a couple fucking of supporters. Yeah, yo. Yeah, yo. Yo. Appreciate the love. Big guy right here. Big guy. Hey, yo, what's up, guys? Yeah, 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 what's Bad way to finish off the night, right, Seuss? A little yeah. bit of vanilla ice cream. Oh yeah, the boys love a little creamer after the game. A little creamer for the boys. Oh yeah, get her going there. The next day. So guys, <laughs> we're here at the number one restaurant in the world. Number one restaurant in the world right now. Just sat down. But before I know, I even get into like showing you guys the food and stuff, I'm gonna go ahead and roll a little clip to give you guys a little bit better understanding of the restaurant. In 2010, we were number 50. And from then on, our goal was to become the best restaurant in the world. Now we have achieved that. What's next? It's quite a big uh, production. So now that you sort of have a better understanding of the restaurant, let's get into the food. But before we can do that, we gotta obviously take into account Kai's dietary restrictions. I don't eat any Definitely any game meat, me organs. I don't eat duck or lamb. I don't get how you yeah. can eat like that. And then cheese is <laughs> yeah. I'll just not do the cheese part. Not That's what I right. just have a hamburger with no meat. Open it up, Jetty. When we got to the table, this little box was already on the table. Our first little bite. It's a classic version of a New York black and white cookie, but it's savory with cheese and apple. 
I'm a tired dog man. I probably got a plastic girl. Hey, you know what? Uh, okay. so when you guys, okay, go to a good restaurant, you know, hand towel. After you wipe your hand, fold it nicely and put it back. And that's called, like, I did. Class. Yeah. Yeah, that they do. You guys just throw it like. There's no, a difference though. So, that I have class. The difference is that is like some of your sons are better than others, and I happen to have class. And he also just happens to ruin everything that he does. He ruins everything, he right? There. Always ruin it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> See, even that, even that fake smile. That's some comfort food here. Scallops with kombu and apple, and for the two of you gentlemen. The addition of seared. Thank you very much. Black truffle right here. I'm guessing is the caviar under the ice right there. <laughs> Guys, check out the level of detailing and the knife work on this cucumber and daikon salad. Jeez. Just getting started. How's the first bite of the caviar? I love the texture. Actually, one shoe I haven't been able to find. I've been looking on the eBay for a long time. It got implosions. New thing is let's get it fucking going. It's my new thing. Ooh, looks like we got a little bit of lobster here. We have the butter poached main lobster tail, the chanterelle mushroom and potato tart. Finish with a mushroom and lobster bisque. Thank you. Thank you. Mushroom, lobster bisque, potato, lobster tail. I'm surprised giving you a pair. Shouldn't be. Mm. Guys, so far everything has been stellar. It's been well worth it. The service so far has been crazy. Literally, like the moment you're finished with something, you take it away right away. Look at this. Look at this. Took the words right in my mouth. So believe it or not, we're about to go tour the kitchen here. I'm really excited to show you guys. This is gonna be dope. Let's go check it out. I want you just to take in how clean and organized everything is. This literally is cleaner than like a hotel room. Wow, this is crazy. This is crazy. They brought us back to the kitchen and they're actually preparing the dish for us here in the kitchen. What is this here? So, while you guys are back here, yeah. um, I'm making a quick night to eat. Oh, wow. It's a brioche style toad. It's popular to be a Hungarian street food. Truffle relish on the bottom, filled with truffle cream. Yes. And, and truffle on top. Truffle. Of course, we have to let Chef do the honors first. Mm. Each and every little seed or whatever he's putting on there. Pretty crazy stuff back here, guys. Everyone has just got their head down, working. Super fortunate that I just got to experience that, guys. Here we have our pumpkin course, wrapped it in seaweed as well as bacon. Jeez. Uh, bacon. What we do from there is roast it till tender. Yeah. This guy just came out of the oven, so we wanted to present it to you. So it's a bacon seaweed pumpkin. Bacon, seaweed, pumpkin. A little smokiness from the bacon, some sweetness from the honey. Oh my god, that smells crazy. This is my favorite course so far. This one's crazy good. Mm -hmm. This is insane. Apple stuffed with duck sauce and healthy potato. Lady Gala apple. All right guys, so we are at the final course of the uh, afternoon here. I'm gonna go ahead and cut into the apple here and we're gonna go ahead and try it all together. Wow, donut time. You already know what time it is. This is filled with apples. There are apples inside of this. Cheers. Oof, just finished up an amazing lunch with Letty. Let's go. All right, people, so we are leaving the number one restaurant in the world. Honestly, it was a crazy experience. Just loved it, loved it, loved it, loved it. So now we are going to carry on with the rest of our day. We're gonna do a little bit of shopping. So, you know, you guys come along with us. You know, maybe buy a couple things, show you guys what's good. New York shopping. Don't know what it is. You already know how to get gang shit. Let go. For bad, for bad. You know, had to throw on the warm mask because it's a little bit cold here. Had to rock the Supreme Arabic mask. All right, guys, we are here. We're in the car right now with the squad. We're on the way to Metropolis, which is a vintage store here in New York. These guys want to do some shopping, and I'm sort of just tagging along. You know, if I see some stuff, I might cop, might do a little bit of this, a little bit of that, but whatever, bro. We're in New York, bro. What, bro? So, oh, yeah, the boys know Metropolis. Fucking Tropsky, Trop schools. Oh, yeah, get her fucking going. Oh, yeah. No, 
I got a couple things I'm probably gonna cop. Little red jerseys for the boys, little wingers. Got a little Datsuk, little Zetterberg for the boys. Oh yeah, we know all about that, don't we? We know all about that, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh fucking yeah, people. Oh yeah, a couple red hot Pepskis for the boys. Do men even know about red hot Pepskis? A little Californication for the boys, they love that. Post game locker room, oh yeah. Basically guys, if you follow my channel, you know you just can never go wrong with a vintage tea. So you know, Kai's doing a little bit of digging right now for some vintage teas, checking out some fire people, you know. Excuse me, sir, can you show me where all your fire stuff is? Oh yeah, I love vintage teas. Oh yeah, it's a Jerry. Love it, love it. It's a little bit of a Travis. Whatever. You see the flex, you know what it is. You see the Supreme pants. Oh yeah, this is Travis. It's such a Travis. Boys love Travis. It's lit, a butterfly effect. Oh yeah, all this Travis. Boys love it. So guys, I'm gonna <laughs> cop this here and I'm gonna get this tea that I saw. So we're just waiting on Kai and Jet who are in the change room right now. They're picking out a couple things. We're gonna see if they end up copying anything. Fire. So a couple of I really hope you didn't stuff anything out. stealing in your pants like you always do. So this is a Jetty cop. Jetty ended up getting this Wu Wear slash Wu Tang inspired tea. And then Kai got the skeleton tea. It's cool, it's pretty edgy. It's going for a little bit of a younger, youthful look. All right, just leaving Metropolis, gang shit. You know, had to pull up, cop a couple things. Successful start so far, people, successful start. All right guys, just pulling up to Patreon of the new. Gonna go see what's good. Whatever, you know, this off-white shit is crazy. Oh yeah, it's in heaven, huh? All the fear of God stuff here. They got a lot of dope stuff here. Check out the new palm, eh? Kai's getting the white ones. I'm grabbing these black ones right here. You guys see it? Comfy swag. Let's get her fucking going her. Okay, people, so that was my trip right there for you. It was amazing, guys. The whole experience, everything from start to finish was well worth it. It's obviously always amazing to get to spend time with your family. And one thing I will say, like, even though I, like, tend to troll my friends or my brother, my family, even sometimes my dad and stuff, like, you guys don't get how much I love my circle of friends and how much I love my family. So big shout out to them for being in the video. And I plan on bringing you guys plenty more footage. Please let me know, please let me know below, please let me know below what more you guys want to see. Please let... Please, please let me know below. <laughs> Holy shit. Can I not fucking talk? Like, this is insane. Please let me know below what you guys want to see more of. Really, really, really looking forward to just pumping out content still for you guys. Actually, right now, believe it or not, I'm about to go head on over to my parents and my dad is cooking an insane, crazy dinner. Trust me, it's going to be a crazy home-cooked meal, so you don't want to miss that. Obviously, coming up on my next episode. So, guys, thank you so much. Thank you so much for the continued support. I'm a big boss. Keep a thing to I come big bucks. Oh my god, big. Ronnie. I come big bucks. Keep a thing to We could get up. Nigga, we could get up. Yeah, chopper leave a nigga doing something.